It's not unusual to see children get so excited about a video game. What's unusual is seeing children get quite so excited about solving math problems. Eighth grade, you'll be choosing numbers and operations, level I, experiments of zero negative values. I'm so nervous. I'm ready. I think this is going to be a very good game. This game is Dimension U. It's a program that mixes video gaming skills with mathematics, and it's in use at middle schools all over Spring ISD. Students are required to answer mathematics questions, but in a gaming environment, they then get to do different things, earn points, do different things, so it's, it's a little bit more fun than just on a standard worksheet. In the world of Dimension U, students find math problems. A whole lot of math problems. Get it, hurry! Got the answer, come on! I got it, I got it, I got it, go! All right, all right, I got it, I got it. Okay, never mind, I don't got it. Math teams from all over Spring ISD have come here to compete on the big screens at the district's annual Dimension U Mega Bowl. It makes it better and improves me in math a lot. At the local campuses, Dimension U is bringing engaging math practice to the students. Which is correct, 0.4 equal 1 eighth, 0.4 less than 1 eighth. I think this is an opportunity to show the math in a different manner. Latonya Rhodes is a teacher at Twin Creeks Middle School. She noticed that while the competition of the game encourages her students to work the math problems, she sees it encouraging teamwork too. It causes them when they're sitting next to each other to kind of work together to answer the problems and I thought that was just unusual because it's an um, individual kind of game but it motivates them to work together to get it right and to be on top as a team. So I really appreciate that, that they do still, even though we're in the computer lab on individual computers, they're still working together in a collaborative manner. 21. 12. 12. Teaming up on me, teaming up on me. I got it. No, it's a cool game. Play. Jarvis Denton is a tough competitor in Dimension U, but he took a time out to talk about the game. It's a helpful game. It's not like the, the violent game that's played. This is like a, like a mind learning game. It's helpful. We got three teams that we're playing. Oh, right now we're, we're losing. So. Okay, well, I'll let you get back to it. I've already messed up the game. Sorry <laughs> it's okay. It seems Jarvis's opponents have been doing well during his absence. Can you go ask him some more questions so we can shoot him? <laughs> it's interesting to do instead of doing it in a worksheet. The game may be high tech, but scratch paper and pencils ensure the answer is right. If you solve it incorrect, it says like you don't get any points. And some people are like really determined to get some points to beat other people. So I guess that's why people are so interested in the game. There you go! This is Desiree Thomas's third year with Dimension U. She teaches the math concepts, but she says the game encourages math practice. Dimension U is used as a benefit for the kids who are doing really, really well or the kids who are struggling. You can use it for both, both um, groups of kids. We use it for an, a reinforcement, like a supplement. It makes math fun. It really does. It's a game. It's something where it's hands-on. They get to visualize. They get to be. It's a competitive game, but in the same sport, it's still fun. The fun and games of Dimension U is encouraging Spring ISD students to keep working at the serious business of learning math. <laughs>